Oh. And it is going to be wonderful, wonderful, oh, wonderful. It certainly is going to so be. So today I am going to be making jelly cake. Oh, yes. oh wow. Yeah. Today is so yeah. great. This is going to be delicious. I know. So you're going to need a few things. You're going to need a packet of flavoured jelly. Today I'm going with raspberry. A bunch of different fruit of your choice. We're using apples, oranges, pears, and frozen berries. We're gonna be using some gelatine, about half a teaspoon. This will help make your jelly stronger to hold it all together. A container and some cling wrap. That's all you're gonna need. And of course, you can use your favorite fruit or use what fruit's in season because it'll be easier to get. And of course, use your favorite jelly flavor as well. Jelly, I love cake. That's right, I'm making a jelly layered cake. Okay, so I've already gotten started so far. What I have done is I've layered my tin with cling film like that. Um, if you don't have a tin, what you can use is maybe just an ice cream container or a plastic container. Then what I've done is I've mixed up my jelly according to the instructions on the back of the box. What we're gonna do though is we're gonna add a bit of gelatin because we want it to be a bit stronger. Because I'm putting fruit in, we don't want it to fall apart because there's a little bit of extra moisture in the fruit. So I'm gonna use half a teaspoon of gelatin, mix it in there, thicken it up, thicken it up. Ooh, ooh, ooh. All right, and then the next thing I've done, or I've started doing, is cutting up my fruit. Now be very careful when you are using a sharp knife. If you're not confident, get someone older to help you. So step one, time to start layering. Layer your fruit into the container. Once you've done one layer, cover it in jelly. Make sure you have a few millimeters of jelly over the fruit layer. Let it stand for a couple of minutes and repeat until you've used all your fruit and then pour in the remainder of the jelly. Step two, place it in the fridge for a couple of hours or until set. Jelly cake, look at this! Oh my goodness, it turned out beautifully. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Whoa. Bring that one over here. Ooh. Whoa. What a catch. Okay, I've got to show this off. Okay, that presentation is amazing. I can see fruit inside there, beautiful bit of garnish on top. This thing, look, it looks like a crystal. That's how cool it looks. <laughs> Nicely, Anna. But the big question is, does it taste good? Mm, I think I can answer that, but let's have a go, eh? Let's find out. Okay, I'm going to slice through you. Take a little bit off there. Mm. 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 How should we go about summing up this flavour, guys? Mm. Oh! Jelly, that's good! Hey, there's more where that came from. What you should do is subscribe to the YouTube channel. Click here. <laughs> He's right, you know. Click right there.